Hey guys, as you saw from today's title, we're going to be looking at a budget-friendly option for improving your TV sound. The Bose Solo 5 is a 2.0 channel soundbar that aims to be a simple and budget-friendly option for improving your TV sound. It has a compact and sleek design, a universal remote control, and built-in Bluetooth for wireless music streaming. However, it also has some limitations that may affect your listening experience. The available connections are very basic with just optical, coaxial and auxiliary connections available in keeping with its budget price. There's no HDMI port, so make sure that any device you want to connect has a coaxial or optical output. The Solo 5 has only two speakers that are both located towards the center of the speaker. There isn't as much stereo separation as we would have liked, and the soundstage is very narrow. The Solo 5 TV sound system is an easy solution, with advanced technologies that deliver the clear audio your TV can't. And dialog mode makes every word even easier to understand without having to adjust the volume from scene to scene. Here are some of the pros and cons of the Bose Solo 5 soundbar. Pros Compact size. The soundbar measures only 21.6 inches long and 2.6 inches tall, making it easy to fit under most TVs or wall mount if you prefer. It has a minimalist and elegant look that blends well with any decor. Easy to use. The soundbar has no buttons or switches, just a plain black grill and a couple of LED indicators. It comes with a large remote control that can also work with your TV, Blu-ray player, and other infrared devices. The soundbar also has an auto-wake feature that turns it on when it detects an audio signal and powers off after 60 minutes of inactivity. Bluetooth compatible. The soundbar has built-in Bluetooth that lets you stream music from your smartphone, tablet, or laptop wirelessly. You can also pair two devices at the same time and switch between them easily. Good clarity to dialogue. The soundbar has a balanced mid-range that can reproduce dialogue-heavy content like podcasts and TV shows clearly. It also has a dialogue enhancement feature that boosts the vocals and makes them more intelligible. Cons Wax Punch The soundbar has an integrated subwoofer that struggles to create a low bass, which can be disappointing for some music fans and movie lovers. It lacks the intensity and depth that an external subwoofer can provide. It also has a bass adjustment feature, but it doesn't make much difference. Narrow Sound Field the soundbar has only two drivers positioned in the center of the unit and angled slightly outwards. This creates a narrow sound field that doesn't fill the room well. It also doesn't support Dolby Atmos or any other surround sound formats, and it downmixes them into stereo. Not very dynamic. The soundbar has a limited dynamic range that makes it sound flat and dull at times. It doesn't handle loud sounds well and can distort at high volumes. It also doesn't have any EQ options or sound modes to customize the sound to your preference. Not a vast improvement on standard TV sound. The soundbar is meant to be a budget-friendly upgrade for your TV speakers, but it doesn't offer a significant improvement in terms of performance. It may be suitable for small rooms or bedrooms, but not for large rooms or home theaters. Summarizing, the Bose Solo 5 is a simple and compact soundbar that can improve your TV sound with minimal fuss. It has a decently neutral sound profile, good dialogue clarity, easy-to-use remote control, and Bluetooth compatibility. However, it also lacks bass, width, dynamics, and features that could make it more enjoyable and versatile. If you're looking for a cheap and basic soundbar for your small TV, the Bose Solo 5 may be worth considering. But if you want more from your soundbar in terms of quality and functionality, you may want to look elsewhere. For buying options and more information about this soundbar, check the links in video description. If you want to see more videos like this, be sure to subscribe to my channel. Now, check out my two next videos. See you soon.